This is Squares, an ordinary guy who just happens to have found himself over the years in some rather extraordinary circumstances. It all began when Squiz was serving with the Australian Special Forces, where individuals and high-performance teams alike are expected to push themselves both physically and mentally beyond their limits. Squiz then found himself in a number of hot spots, such as Afghanistan, Somalia and the Gaza Strip, not as a soldier, but as a humanitarian aid worker. Essentially, it was his job to deal with the threats and overcome obstacles, maximising the delivery of humanitarian supplies for those caught up in the conflict. That meant that Squiz not only had to be culturally aware, but also cognizant of the conflict dynamics and those who wielded influence and control over the ever-changing front line. Effective communication was essential for ensuring successful negotiations. Squiz's workplace, and those he had come to help, soon had a prolific impact on his motivation and passion to extend himself beyond his employer's expectations. On behalf of the women of Afghanistan, Squiz put on a burqa and ran a marathon. And whilst working in the West Bank and Gaza Strip, Squiz thought he'd do his bit to help with the Middle East crisis. So he put together a four-person team that included an Israeli and a Palestinian and headed to East Timor to compete in an adventure race that was being held in the name of peace. Squiz's biggest challenge, however, came whilst working for the United Nations World Food Program in Nepal. With Everest so close, it seemed logical to use it as a platform to raise awareness of the global hunger crisis. There it is in a nutshell. Squiz is now available to share his unique insights and proven strategies for success. Book now you'll be blown away. And started off on my journey, and I knew pretty much straight away I would have to say goodbye to my Sherpa at that point. Why? Because, well, he'd already used all of his option, but he was using that dodgy mask. And I felt really bad, but he didn't mind one bit because I was his customer. And he said, yeah, you go for it. And so, and, so, and I put his mask on, and it was great because it was actually really warm. And, uh, but he'd eaten a lot of garlic. <laughs> Really stunk, but it just didn't matter. Oh, it was just. What a successful night, ladies. Oh, absolutely. Been to Everest and back. Yeah. Everest and back. We don't need to go, go. now, so <laughs> we've decided. Hey. We talked the whole journey through, didn't we? We yeah. were doing it. It'd be fun. And then freezing our butt cheeks off, we decided. Very inspirational, but. Very. Absolutely amazing. Yeah.